Pokemon mystery boxes are some of the most fun that we have here on the channel. You never know what to expect when opening up a mystery box because sometimes they're amazing, sometimes they're pretty good, and sometimes they're a complete scam. But every once in a while, we have a mystery box sent over here completely unexpected. Take, for example, today's video. There was a package waiting at my P.O. box from a YouTuber called PokeTube Tyler. All right, so look, I have literally no idea what could possibly be in here. I see a bunch of these, like, uh, envelope things or padded envelopes, whatever you want to call them. That have like a bunch of things written on them. So like this one says open first. And then I'm going to assume that's open second. There's a bunch more in there. All right. Open first. Let's see what we get in our first mystery bag here. Um, I feel a bunch of items. So I guess I'll just pull them all out at the same time. And it looks like, oh, there it is. We got Lost Origin. What are these stickers on here? This must be, okay, I think it's like a Best Buy order sticker, actually. Okay, so we got these with the sticker. We'll take them. And I can't just keep all this for myself, so I actually want to pay it forward and give all this away to three subscribers here on the channel. Ten of the giveaway, all I have to do is, number one, smash the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And then number three, leave a comment down below in the comment section. All right, Tyler, huge thank you for sending this over here. That's way too kind of you. Again, I was like completely unexpected. I was like, wait, wait what is this? And then um, I, I got an email about it. I was like, oh, okay. There's there's a mystery box. I think we got to open it up. And uh, this is just the beginning of this thing. So, again, I have no idea what to expect. But PokeTube Tyler is actually a YouTuber uh, that opens up Pokemon cards as well. So, make sure you check him out. Show the love. Horsey, Meditite, and... A dust talk's not hollow. I think it's kind of funny that Best Buy actually just puts big stickers on these packs and stuff like that because I know some people want to keep stuff sealed. So it's kind of weird when they just like, yeah, we'll just throw a big sticker on the front of it. And like, even if you were to give it as a gift to somebody, it's kind of random. I don't know if they always do that, but uh, yeah, that's just kind of like what we got on these ones. It's kind of weird. I wonder like, <laughs> I don't know. I wonder how that works. Litwick. Ah, what is happening? Two Litwicks. Okay. Spirit Dome and a Vile Plume Hollow. Okay. Little kind of scared me there, but that kind of gave me an idea, actually. Maybe we should do a video where we, like, order something from Best Buy or some kind of, like, retail store where they actually go and pick the packs themselves. And let's see what the employees pick. Let's see if they can pick the good packs for us. Maybe there's, like, an employee that just picks all the good packs. I don't really know. Um, but maybe we should try that at some point and see if we actually get the stickers on those as well. I think it'd be kind of interesting just to see what happens. Maybe we can order from a couple different places. Shop it, lamp it, and a Mr. Mine. All right, we got our open second... Let's see what we got in this one now. All right. So we're switching it up maybe. Let's see. I feel some more. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I think, yep, we got Astral Radiance. Let's see if they have the stickers. Oh, they don't. These ones are clean on the front. Okay. So now we have three Astral Radiance. Let's see if we can kick it up a notch and get some pulls out of here. Let's get some... Let's, look, I mean, <laughs> I've actually been kind of lucky with Astral Radiance. Like, I didn't attempt to complete this set. That, yeah, thankfully, because that's a little too crazy for me. But um, I was able to pull some really good stuff out of Astral Radiance in the last few videos that we've done of it. Absolute Hollow. All right. Uh, if these are also from Best Buy, I'm going to just go ahead and say that that employee, I'm not. I'm going to have to go with not going to go with that employee to pick the packs for this. If, if we try this, I'm just going to just gonna go ahead and say that. Okay. Psychic. We got Eevee, Heracross, Mantine, Sweet Honey. And a shaman non hollow. Come on, pour some of that sweet honey on this pack. Give me something good on pack number six. Come on, pack number six. Remember, this is for you guys. So I just want to get some good stuff. One, two, three, four on that one. Then we're going to move on to our third envelope. Let's see what we get it. All right. We got Ashawat Hoot Hoot. And literally, I've, I have literally no idea what's in any of this stuff. Puchiana, Mantine, and a non hollow red. Envelope number three. Open third. Okay. Oh, I see some more. I see some more sleeve packs, and it's Brilliant Stars. This has to be where the luck is, right? Okay, these ones are clean as well. All right, all right. These have to be... In fact, you know what? I'm actually... I'm just going to take all these out. We got the Charizard one in there. We got the Shaman in that one. I'm going to take them all out and get them ready to go. And then we got Arceus in that one. All right. All right. <laughs> Come on. Come on. We got to get something out of these. Here we go. All right. And make sure you guys watch all the videos from this last week or so. I don't know exactly when this video drop is dropping, but we opened up some really cool stuff, man. Pokemon has just been hitting home runs left and right with different products, different stuff, different ideas we've been doing on the channel. I've been having, like, ridiculous amount of fun hanging out with you guys making content. King Lord VMAX, that's actually our first real hit. We'll take it. Okay, pack number two. All the hits. All the hits. Ooh, that's a white code card. Okay, I actually saw that one. So the best we can do on this one is get a trainer gallery pull. All right, all right. Dusclops. Ah, I wonder if uh, the newest set's in here. Silver Tempest. Mewtwo. All right, all right. Uh, spoilers, right? I still need the Unknown Rainbow. And I, I I, need to pull it. I need to pull it. I have to just pull it myself, too. Like, I, I have to pull it myself. I know I could just go buy it. I 
I know a lot of people said, Red, why don't you just go buy the card? Buy the card for whatever, 20 or $30. I refuse. Cleansing gloves and a heat ray. What do we have here? Open fourth. I think it says custom. Ooh, we got the logo on here. Custom PokeTube Tyler Pack. Oh, this could be good. Okay, let's crack this. I wonder what's in this. Hmm, okay. Custom PokeTube Tyler. Ooh, okay. Start here. No, whoops. Start here. No card trick required. I like that. Okay, okay. You know what? Okay, I'm going to put this to the side for a second. And I want to throw in some packs as well for this because we can't just have PokeTube Tyler thrown in. So I'm throwing in 12. Fusion Strike Booster Packs right now to you guys. Let's just chuck these in there. Whatever we get out of these will also be getting given away. Remember, there's going to be three winners for all these cards. Every single card. Smeargle. Let's see what we get, though. I want to see if we get a big Gengar. Come on. Arcanine. All right. Fusion Strike. I haven't opened it in a while. It's kind of just like, I don't know. I just feel like opening it. And and this is another set where I didn't try to complete the, the whole set. So there's still a lot of cards that I've actually never opened from this set. So, I mean, what would be better than just pulling some of these and giving them to you guys? Hopefully, I can get some of them here. We got Basculin and Toxtricity Hollow. Also, Fusion Strike is before we started doing, like, these Trainer Gallery things. I like the code card on this one, though. So, like, there's no Trainer Gallery. Imagine if Fusion Strike had a Trainer Gallery. I feel like Trainer Galleries just make the set so much better. We're going to see what happens in the new Scarlet and Violet um, generation as well. Toxtricity. What is happening? All right. So, we had two different versions of Toxtricity. Third tries the charm, perhaps. Let's see. And then besides that... um custom pack there that we're not going to be doing the Patrick on there's also some more stuff in this mystery box I think there's some things in there that even say open last so that could be pretty exciting I'd assume golem oh man is today just not our lucky day we got to turn this around I mean it, are, it automatically is our lucky day because we got this mystery box sent over here but like let's turn it around the hits at least because right now the best pull that we got is a Kingler V Max which is not too great Persian Meloetta okay come on give me a big Gengar out of here or a Mew or something cool here we go. Next booster pack. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We're gonna get, we're gonna get something. Ready? This is where it all turns around for us. This is where everything changes. Pamper. Oh, whoo! Second half of the fusion strike booster packs. Is that where everything is? Let's find out. And these are straight from a booster box. I literally just grabbed them out of the box. So, it's like I, I think they're all in order. I think these are on the left side. Just grab straight back. Makuita and an Hetelion B. I'm so happy to see a regular V card right now. I gotta remember, I gotta remember these sets that don't have the trainer gallery. The pull rates are just lower, and that's just how it is normally. Let's see. Up, oh, you know what? Any white code card packs now that we have, I'm just gonna go straight through because that literally means you probably can't get anything. Unless there's some sort of error, or maybe there's like, I don't think there's any radiance in this set. Oh man. Okay, we'll go straight through this one. I don't think you can get anything else in the reverse in this. Yeah, you can. We'll do that. We'll, we'll do that. Anything that looks like it could have a hit. Oh my god, these packs are bad right now. Whoo! <laughs> oh my god. Come on! Oh my god, what is happening? <laughs> oh, man. Alright, Fusion. Bro, that is a joke. Okay, you think? This is where all the hits are. I think this is where, the, where all the hits are going to be. Literally going to be in this thing, if I can get it open. Here we go. Okay, no pack trick required here. Let's see. Let's see. This this might be it. This might be what we've been waiting for right now. Okay. Ooh. Starting off with the Lightning Hollow. Who year is that? 2020. Okay. It's, we're coming back a little bit. Okay. We got another Hollow. We got Trainer Hollow. We got Boss's Orders. This is already where everything's turning around. Every single card is at least a Hollow, it looks like. Yes. Oh, we're moving into Shinies now. We got a Rotom. We got Radiant Steelix. Two Shinies. Giratina V. Come on. We got Origin Form, Dialga V, all these. Okay, this is where all our hits are right now. Look at this. Beautiful. Chandelure. We got Bird Keeper. Toy Catcher Gold. Woo! What just happened, bro? Lugia Legend Top Half? Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. Okay. That's amazing. That's beyond amazing. Oh, we just got the other half, bro. No way. Oh, my God. God, I actually don't think I've ever seen this card fully, like, with both pieces, like, combined. Oh, my God. Tyler literally just making it look easy by putting the Lugia together. This is insane. They're Heart Gold Soul Silver Era. Just put both pieces together. Oh, my God. All right, we got more. Open fifth, and there's actually a note on here. On my channel, the Hyper Rare Raiders know I love my Pokemon cards and packs in different languages, especially vintage Pokemon cards and packs. My favorite cards being in Japanese. 
It's like traveling the world and feeling what it's like to open a pack long ago in a different country and language. Here are two vintage or older packs, one being in Spanish and one in Chinese. Good luck. All right, here we go. Let's see what's in this one. Hopefully I don't cut anything that I'm not supposed to be cutting here. I think we're good. Okay, so I think there's two packs in here. Let's hope, let's let's pull the first one out. Yeah, there's definitely two. Okay, first one is oh, hot gold soul silver. Let's go. I think we actually have opened up these exact ones on the channel before, but dude, let's go. We that, this is amazing to be able to open this up. All right, so yeah, there's definitely there's five cards in here. All right, there's five cards in here. We have opened a box of these before, and the the pull rates are nuts. Um, but hot gold soul silver, the pull rates are always always insane. But all right, so we got one. Let's see what we get. Snubble. I don't know what the pack trick is. I can't remember. You got a Meowth. Spinarak. I don't think you're guaranteed a rare or anything. Metapod, maybe. Last is, oh, that is a rare. Okay, we got a Cleffa non-hollow rare. All right, next booster pack. Come on. Oh, and here's the Chinese one, and it is Legend Maker. I know this one as well, too. I think, yeah, we definitely opened up a box of these, but they're so much fun to open because you get that old school vintage, like, Pokemon card artwork for a lot cheaper. Uh, but we get the Chinese Legend Maker with the Arcanine on the front. All right, here we go. Let's see what we get out of this next one here. Come on, baby. All right, are we ready? I don't know what the pack trick is on these, but it's crazy because these are even older. 2006. A lot older, actually, than the one that was already pretty old. We got Magby. Oh, this is the saddest artwork every time I see this. So depressing. <laughs> Oh, okay. We got a Wobbuffet. Let's see if we can end it on something. Oh, non-hollow. Wait, actually, the Wobbuffet was the rare, so it was probably one from the back. And it looks like we are at the last package here. This seems to be some graded cards from a local grading company. So I'm curious to see what this actually looks like here. And let's pull these out. Hopefully, I don't spoil anything. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, wait a second. Hint. This is how the labels look in case you want to cover them. <laughs> oh, dude. Perfect. <laughs> okay, so they're in the middle. Okay, so I literally just have to cover the whole thing. Okay. All right, so let's do the first card here. Hopefully, I don't mess it up. I think we're good. Wait, no. It's facing the other way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, hopefully, I got it. Oh, I'm good. Okay. Woo, dude, it's a Venusaur from base set. Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. Japanese base Venusaur. Okay, we're going to reveal it. So, this looks like it's sort of like Beckett or CGC where you can get, like, subgrades. All right, let's see what happens. Front looks good. Um, the back looks actually really good. This looks pack fresh. That's kind of crazy. Okay, so we have, let's see, this could be good. This could actually be really good. A nine on the corners, okay. A 9.5 on the centering. We have edges as an eight and the surface as an eight. So what's that going to be overall? Like an eight five or something? Let's see. And it is an 8.5 near mid to mid plus. All right, let's see the next one. I, I'm, this is probably, probably going to be an English card from the back. Let's see. Oh, it's the Umbreon V on R, dude. I love this card. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. I can't get enough of the Umbreons from Brilliant Stars. They're too good. All right. So, we have... Let's see. Let's see. Uh, corners, 9.5. Centering is a 10. Okay. We have edges as a 9.5. Surface as a 9.5. That could only mean one thing. I think we have a 9.5 card overall. 9.5 mid plus. Let's go. All right. But that is going to do it. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. And thank you to Tyler for sending over this mystery box. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to smash the like button on your way out. If you want more content, YouTube's automatically recommending a couple at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day. And I will see you on the next one.